good everybody welcome to an epic my damn toys video today ladies and gentlemen the monthly mbt battle royal is finally back with us you guys know we were trying to get hell's gate knocked out of the way and then my son was born and we had a lot of stuff going on around the house and it was just you know a big toughie trying to get this battle royal in because you guys think that these things take me like 10 minutes to do the battle royals are actually something that take me very long while to do because it takes a long time to set the figures back up and then edit and then film and then and everything together guys it can take quite some time but we're not going to get into that right now we're going to get into the mdt monthly battle royal you guys know if you've been here before you guys know how this thing works today we are loaded up with a hundred different superstars in the ring i think it's a hundred i tried my best to get to 100 we may be a little bit under 100 but nonetheless guys today the mdt battle royal champion chad gable is finally here with us he's finally set to defend his championship you know he should have to relinquish it here today but i'm gonna give it to him you know uh, pennywise had his title strip and uh, today we are not going to be stripping him of the championship he's going to put this thing on the line though he does get the champion's advantage and we will get into that as we break down the rules so let's go ahead and dive into that so getting into it guys breaking down the rules of the mdt monthly battle royal we have 100 men or around 100 men i don't know the freaking exact number i think it's 90 something we're just going to say 100 so the rules are as follows the champion gets a champion's advantage so he will not be inserted until the second swipe so basically what i'm going to do is I'm going to set the champion off to the side. Chad Gable will go off to the side. I will hit it with a good swipe here. We'll see who's eliminated and then take all those guys out of the ring and then we will place the champion in the dead center because he gets a little champion's advantage being the champion, obviously. And then we'll run it through and then we will see who the last man is standing inside the ring when it is all said and done. The way you get eliminated is if you fall completely off the table. You guys will see here, there is a table that the rings are setting on and if you fall off and you hit the floor, you are automatically eliminated that is your automatic thing unless you're on somebody okay if you're on top of somebody you're not eliminated if you fall off the table but if you fall off and you touch the floor the carpet with any part of your body you are eliminated now as far as eliminations go if you're touching the table guys two feet must hit the ground unless you're wearing pants cuffs for example Shinsuke Nakamura right here if his pants cuffs are touching the ground instead of his feet he will be eliminated that is like a little cheat code that people with pants can get away with our truth Jeff Hardy Shinsuke Nakamura Matt Hardy guys like that do follow that rule and they have to because if they you know they could easily get through by in different rounds by just their pants cuffs hitting and not their feet we've had that rule set in since the beginning so today i brought back a ton of guys we got the memes of the channel we got some returning champions we got a lot of stuff going on i'm probably in the makings of making a new mdt battle royal championship set to defend here today but we are not completed with that and i really like this title design so i don't know let me know what you guys think of that down in the comment section below with that being said guys let's go ahead and dive into our first swipe i think that does it for the rules we used to have it where if you got eliminated on the first swipe you couldn't compete in the next month's battle royal but we're gonna not do that for now we're just gonna get into this swipe see who the hell walks out of here another thing i wanted to mention is if you guys can get in here we actually have a second basic ring inside this ring so that we have a little tier set up that way it makes the battle royal a little bit more unpredictable you know you don't know where the hell this thing's gonna go i guarantee it's gonna slide when i hit all these figures so we'll just have to see about that but we got two tiers going let's see who's gonna survive who will outlast them all here in the mdt battle royal let's go ahead with swipe number Number one, I gotta move my damn lamp out of the way. It's preventing me from swiping. Okay. Good God in heaven, Brad. Okay, so the ring definitely flew out of the ring, and we had a shit ton of people fly all over the place. So we definitely need to start off with the people on the floor. You guys can see here, Christian and Goldust did hang on, and uh, I guess, yeah, let's go ahead and go straight to the floor. You guys will see down here, we do have quite a few eliminations. We got uh, our truth over here, Samoa Joe. Ultimate, is Ultimate Warrior? Yeah, his feet are touching back here. His feet are touching. I thought he was off the ground, but he is not. Apollo, Ultimate Warrior, Drew McIntyre, Shinsuke Nakamura, Heath Slater, Roman Reigns, Jinder Mahal, Ryback, Big Torito, Brock Lesnar, and Undertaker all biting the dust on the floor. So they are automatically all eliminated, but we do have some guys around the ring here. Some people did survive. You know, Goldust and Christian did hung, hung on. They hung on the middle of the front there, so they are safe. All these guys are safe. Jeff Hardy selling cigarettes behind the gymnasium. Dean Ambrose and Jack Gallagher are all safe right here. They will all remain. It looks like our little mask killer guy is alive. Little Torito is safe. You can see there his left foot is off the ground. It does look like, however, Sting and Miz are going to be gone. Their feet are touching both 
feet there for Sting. And uh, if my uh, if my sight is serving me correctly right there, the Miz's left foot is touching and the right foot is also touching up under Sting. So these two guys will be gone, but all of these guys will be safe. So I got to clean this up right here. Safe, 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 eliminated, eliminated. So what I'm going to do now is just put these guys on the ground that way. You know, I know everybody is eliminated. Coming forward a little bit, I mean, my God, how the hell in the blue hell does Seth Rollins fall all the way here to this notepad off of the ground. I feel like if that notepad was not there, Brad, he would have definitely been eliminated, but Seth Rollins does survive. It looks like Ricochet is on top of Edge, and he will survive. We got just random ish thrown around right here. Ricochet will be safe. Edge will be eliminated. We got some other stuff going on right here. It looks like Rakesh Lee is eliminated. If you guys were wondering who that is, you got a Keith Lee with a Rikishi head. Rakesh Lee. Jason Jordan eliminated. Finn Balor survives here on top. He got a few guys riding the surf wave right there. Uh, Shane McMahon will be gone. Ty Dillinger is gone. Braun Strowman is gone. A lot of people landing face down right here and eliminating themselves. Ty Dillinger, Braun Strowman, Kofi Kingston back here. Also looks like Big E is eliminated as well. Looks like Big E is eliminated. Kane's safe though. Go ahead and get these guys up here. I'm gonna go ahead and put these guys in the ring. God, look at all this madness that is happening. Buddy Murphy is safe. Looks like Eric Young is gonna be safe. Lars Sullivan's safe. Rey Mysterio is eliminated with the toes touching. Finn Balor is safe. My God, there's so many bodies up in here. So Finn Balor safe, Ziggler safe, Eric Young safe, Buddy Murphy safe, Chris Jericho eliminated, Lars is safe, 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 eliminated, eliminated, safe, Carl Anderson is eliminated, Macho Man is safe, he was safe, I saw it, safe, 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 uh, Matt Hardy actually, Matt Hardy up under HBK and, uh, not Cesaro, that's Jason Statham if you will, is eliminated, Sami Zayn is eliminated, Tyson Kidd is eliminated so these two guys are safe but these three guys are eliminated Woo! my god it's hard to get all these bodies so coming right here guys it does look like my boy john cena is eliminated andrade however is safe keith lee also eliminated neville looks to be safe john cena is gone uh all these guys over here look to be safe besides elias and stone cold steve austin back here in the corner i don't know how well you guys can see that but under there way back there behind goldberg stone cold steve austin is eliminated Eliminated. James Ellsworth safe. Neville safe. Curtis Axel. Axel Mania and Keith Lee are both gone. It looks like Big Cass is gone. Cole safe. Randy Orton safe. Kane safe. Cass gone. Mojo Rawley gone. Bobby Trashley gone. Batista Lou Gallo safe. Goldberg safe. Get Gulak safe. And Tony Nese safe. However, if you look right here, guys, Stone Cold is gone. But look at that right foot of Elias chilling on that little piece of whatever that is. That is going to be considered safe and Elias will be moving on but I gotta add up all these eliminations and see how many freaking people are gone. Alright guys so on that first swipe we did have 36 total eliminations as you guys can see here's the full field that was eliminated absolutely ridiculous. Now I gotta set all these guys back up and we gotta go for swipe number 2 and we gotta insert our MDT Battle Royal Champion Chad Gable to see if he can survive swipes leading up to the championship. Let's find out what the hell is gonna happen. Alright guys we are finally moving on to swipe number 2 I cannot believe we have that many eliminations on the last swipe. Hopefully we get the same amount of action here on the second number swipe. So why the hell did I throw number in the middle of the sentence? But we're adding the Battle Royal... We're adding the Battle Royal Champion right now, Chad Gable. He will go in the middle, as you guys know. We're going to put him straight in the middle right here and see what goes down and just see how this damn thing goes. Hopefully that man can retain or, or do something. I think the only one to ever retain, it's either Brock Lesnar or Finn Balor, I think, is the only one who's right here. We'll see how he does as well. And you know what I would love? If somebody can keep up with all the Battle Royal Champions and let me know how many times they've been Battle Royal Champion and maybe list the order down in the comment section below, that would be awesome. Anyways, guys, let's go ahead and hit it for swipe number two. Woo! So for floor eliminations, guys, it does look like we have quite a few here. Not as many as the last time, but we do have Tony Nese, Akam, or Rezar. I can't tell from here. We got Macho Man. We got Dash Wilder. We got one of the Usos. We got Pac slash Neville. On the front here, you guys will see that Goldberg barely survived his foot up on the apron, as well as Triple H. Both of those guys barely surviving right there, as you guys can see. His feet are on the mat. His feet are on the apron, so both of those guys will be safe. Christian and Jason Statham and Kalisto are also safe, but these guys are safe. Selling six 
cigarettes behind the gymnasium safe. Looks like all these guys right here in this area are actually safe, including HBK right here. So he will be safe. All these guys in this area will be safe. Let's go ahead and make sure that they get put inside the ring because I have eliminated people by accident before, and we don't want that happening here today in the Battle Royal. Coming over here, guys, what else do we have? It looks like Ricochet is safe. Matt Riddle is safe. Austin Aries is eliminated. Both feet touching right here for Aries, so he will join the people on the floor. Lars Sullivan right here is also eliminated. We got Buddy Murphy, who looks to be safe. It looks like... Oh, I almost eliminated Buddy Murphy. That wouldn't have been good. Matt Riddle is safe. It looks like Batista's feet are actually touching. If you look at that, not only did he do the splitsies, but he is eliminated. So Matt Riddle will be safe. It looks like my boy Dolph Ziggler did bite the dust, so Ziggler and Batista will both be gone. <laughs> Tommaso Ciampa's right foot is off the ground, so he will be safe. It looks like the other Uso is actually also eliminated. If you guys look right here, both of his feet are touching right there. Or actually, that right foot. Uh, no, actually, he is safe. He is actually safe. I thought he was gone. Ziggler and Batista gone. Mustafa Ali safe. Sheamus is eliminated. If you guys can see there, his feet are touching. Gulak's feet are touching right there. It looks like KO is safe. No way Jose is eliminated. We got a lot of eliminations right here that I gotta be careful with. Hardy and KO are safe. Jose is eliminated. Gulak eliminated. It looks like Adam Cole back here. Also safe on top of Daniel Bryan who is eliminated. So, eliminated, eliminated. Styles eliminated. Gargano, Gallows, Brian Pillman. All these guys are eliminated. Randy Orton in the back back there is also eliminated. We gotta get all these guys out of here. Here. These three are eliminated. Ali safe. It looks like Pete Dunn's left foot is safe. So these two guys are safe. Safe. Eric Young out. God, it gets so sticky right here. He's gone. 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 Safe. So he's gone. Safe, safe. Pete Dunn actually was gone, unfortunately. Shaking my damn head. Little E safe. Eric Young out. Evan Bourne eliminated. Randy Orton eliminated. Jack Gallagher is safe. Gold Dust is safe. Out. Big Show is out. Cactus Jack is out. Cedric safe. Akum slash Razar is safe. And all these guys over here are safe. So now I have to get all of these mother effers back in the ring and set them up to go for swipe number three. The champion Chad Gable did survive for now. All right, guys, I believe we had 24 total eliminations on that one. We got some good names still left in here. Little E, everyone's favorite man. We got the Battle Royal Champion, Chad Gable. We have Finn Balor. We got Adam Cole. We got some great names in here. I'm ready to hit swipe number three, see if we can take a step closer to crowning that champion. I don't know if I should hit him like this or if I should hit the ring like that and like over the top. I think I want to hit it like hit the ring while coming over the top. That way, you know, we get some launches, you know, we can get some crazy shit going on. Let's just see what what happens oh my god Jesus Christ in heaven. I think it'd only be fair if I pushed him this way too. I want to hit these four guys just like a like a little Iron Man pulse action to see what we got going on. All right, all right, now we can see who was eliminated. All right, guys, I can't wait to freaking see how that went down on camera, like with the, because I know some people launched up in the air. I don't even know how the hell that happened right there, but, well, I know how it happened. I just don't, I, I want to see what the results were there, but we did have a few eliminations on the floor, as you guys can see. Four eliminations on the floor. Buddy Murphy hanging on the front right there. Little E is eliminated, so I know a ton of people are excited about that. His feet are touching. He's, like, doing a crunch forward motion. He is eliminated. He will join the people on the floor. Buddy Murphy is safe. It does, however, look like if we slow Slide over here. We do have quite a few eliminations. Kalisto is gone. Finn Balor is on top of Christian, who is eliminated. So Finn Balor will be safe, but Christian will be gone. HBK joins company where he is eliminated. Adam Cole eliminated. Goldberg eliminated. Champa and Mustafa Ali and Kevin Owens are all safe. So all three of these guys will go back inside the ring. Finn Balor is also safe. Goldberg gone. Jack Gallagher gone. It looks like all these guys right here are gone except for... Is that the champ is champion gone? It does look like the champion's feet are gone. So Cedric Alexander will be safe, but it, and Matt Riddle will be safe, Andrade safe, but Ellsworth, Chad Gable, Goldberg, Gallagher, Kane, Adam Cole, and Scott Dawson all gone. Now if we come forward right here, guys, it does look like Jeff Hardy is gone, but this masked wrestler guy is safe, so he will be safe, but Jeff Hardy's toes are touching, so that is unfortunate for Jeff. Masked guy goes back inside the ring, and if we're trying to get the people in the back back here, it does look like Ricochet is safe, Triple H is safe, Elias is gone, and Jason Statham 
also gone, unless I get under there and he's actually safe. All right, guys, so upon further investigation, Jason Statham was actually safe, so we're down to the top 13, and this may be the most star-studded packed finale we will ever have here in the MDT Battle Royal. Buddy Murphy, Tommaso Ciampa, Scary Mask Killer, Michael Myers Guy, Ricochet, Finn Balor, Kevin Owens, Mustafa Ali, Seth Rollins, Matt Riddle, Cedric Alexander, Triple H, Andrade Cianomas, and Jason Statham. I'm freaking hyped. I don't give a damn who wins this thing. It's going to be exciting. I want to get a good swipe right here, see who we're going to have in the finale. This could be the finale. We're going to have to find out together. Let's go ahead and swipe and see what the hell goes on. All right, guys, it does look like to me that Buddy Murphy will be eliminated. Tommaso Ciampa will be eliminated. Scass Mary got... Mary guy. Scass Mask... What the hell am I saying? Scary Mask guy will be eliminated. So these three guys will be eliminated. Ricochet is safe. His foot is on top of Finn Balor. But it does not... I mean, Kevin Owens. But it does not look like Kevin Owens or Finn Balor will be safe. Nor Seth Rollins or Mustafa Ali or Andrade Cien Almas. So we could be looking at a very slim finale alley right here. Eliminated, eliminated. Seth Rollins gone. Mustafa Ali's left foot is touching as well. Matt Riddle is safe. Andrade Cien is not. So right now we have Ricochet and Matt Riddle in the finale. These guys are all gone. Gone. And over here in the back, it does look like Cedric Alexander, both of his feet are touching, Jason Statham's feet are touching, and Triple H's right boot is off the ground. So our triple threat finale will be Triple H versus Matt Riddle versus Ricochet for the MDT Battle Royal Championship. All right, guys, we're down to the main event. Triple threat match for the MDT Battle Royal Championship, ready to set this thing off. Where the hell did I put the championship title at? Oh, shitty me. Dams. Did I lose the championship? How the hell? Here it is, you dumb jackass. All right, guys, so we're down to the final three. Matt Riddle, who this is his first ever Battle Royal, if I'm not mistaken. Ricochet and Triple H all battling for the MDT Battle Royal Championship. I'm going to put my phone on record so that way we can record this thing, find out if, you know, indeed who wins this thing. And obviously, we're going to have a new champion, so I am definitely going to be videoing it on slow-mo so that we can capture all the epic moments if we we have, you know, uh, if, if anything's indisputable, if we got to review it, I want to make sure that we have everything on video so that we don't have any crazy stuff go down. So the phone is going and we are about to get ready to set this thing off. I really want to make sure that we get a good little pop right here because I'm not going based off anything but the first hit. So whoever touches the table last will be declared the champion and we'll go to slow-mo review and we will see who wins this thing. I want to make sure they're on even planes though. That way we make sure that everybody gets a fair shake at this thing and we don't have any cases where, you know, I accidentally hit somebody earlier than I'm supposed to right there. Yeah, see, Ricochet needs to be this way just a little bit. Ooh, I don't know if I trust it. All right, so again, whoever touches the table last will be declared the champion. So as soon as somebody hits, they are eliminated. I got it on slow-mo cam. Let's see who wins this thing. All right, here we go. I'm going to go see who won this thing. Regardless of who wins, I'm hyped for it, man. To be honest with you, I don't care who wins. Let's find out together. I'm going to review the footage. All right, guys, so here we are, and I'm going to be dead-ass honest with you guys. I'm going to have to plug this ish into the software to figure out who won because this is super hard. I cannot honestly tell. It's so freaking close. Again, I'm probably have to gonna have to put this thing in super duper slow motion. Let me know what you guys think. I'm gonna run it through the super duper slow mo, but one time so you guys can see it again. I want to make sure that we get a really good shot at it. You know, usually it's like without a shadow of a doubt, I know who wins. But on this one, to me, it looks like Matt Riddle hits first, then Triple H, then Ricochet. But I'm honestly not sure. I'm going to have to put it in super duper slow motion cam. And you guys will find out the winner after that. So we're just going to run it back. We're going to run this thing through slow mo cam now. And find out who the hell won. I think you guys saw it clear as day just like I did. None other than Ricochet is your new MDT Battle Royal Grip the Effing Championship. And my God, what an epic performance from Ricochet, man. I thought for sure that Triple H might have stole it from him, but it looks like Ricochet is your new champion. Congratulations to Ricochet. I enjoyed it. I thought he put on a fantastic performance, outlasting all the other men. We will be back again next month. 
for the MDT Battle Royal. My my birthday's actually coming up in 11 days, so that's a little little Easter egg fart in a bag for you. But anyways, guys, thank you guys so very much for watching. Subscribe to the channel for more epic WWE action figure videos. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at my name toys, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you. Thank you.